Adam, it's been a long time since we've hit the single digits. Yesterday was cold, right? There was, you know, we dropped down into the low to mid 20s around the Puget Sound area, but it's been a long time since we've hit the single digits. If you look back at the past 10 years, we really haven't gotten anywhere close to the single digits. Well, back in 1950, on this day, January 31st, 1950, we hit a whopping zero degrees, and uh, we haven't gotten anywhere close to that since then. Uh, and you know what, to be honest, I don't know if we'll ever do it again. Here are some pictures back in 1950 in Seattle. And what do you know? Of course, a lot of snow. This is, these are uh, buses stuck in downtown Seattle back then. Uh, Check this out. These are, these are folks shoveling off the tracks. You see the Smith Tower there off in the distance is down in the Soto District. Uh, here are folks uh, skiing at the West Seattle Golf Course. Bill, you, you've you yeah. played there, haven't you? Oh, yeah. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? That's it the back cool nine shot. for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yes. You really is. feel it on that back nine going up and down those hills. Oh, yeah, you do. Yeah, if you don't get a cart, absolutely. Look at all that snow on the ground and, uh, and on the cars and all of that. It was a pretty remarkable time back then. They had over 57 inches of snow in total for the entire month of January. And they ended the month with an Arctic blast that sent temperatures down to zero degrees. Again, I, Seattle's grown up a lot since then. Uh, we have a lot more buildings, a lot more concrete nowadays. I just don't see that ever happening again. In fact, we haven't been down in the single digits for decades now at this point. So a look here at our Capitol Hill camera. We're mostly cloudy right now. And what I'm expecting moving forward here through the rest of the week is staying dry through Thursday. We got Groundhog Day there on Thursday. That'll be a lot of fun. Uh, then on Friday, showers return. That'll be a breezy day for us and we'll stick with a few showers heading into the weekend. Guys.